welcome in this session we are going to study the projections of a straight line a straight line is a one dimensional element connecting two points by the shortest distance and the length is always a true length tl the projection of a line can be obtained by drawing the projections of its end points on different planes so let's start a straight line ab is perpendicular to hp and parallel to vp where the point a is h units above hp and point b is d units in front of vp observe the front view of line ab as line a dash b dash as you can see from top point b is visible and it hides point a so projectors from point b passing through a meets hp at point b a which is the top view so let's see how it will appear on paper for this first draw a horizontal reference line x y then draw a line a dash b dash above and perpendicular to x y with end point a dash at a distance of h units from x y next mark a point b a below x y at a distance of d units in line with line a dash b dash line a dash b dash and point b a are the projections of the line ab on vp and hp respectively now let us take another case a line ab is inclined to hp at an angle theta and parallel to vp at a distance of d units point a is h1 units above hp while the point b is h2 units above hp well look at the diagram carefully the projection of line ab onto bp and hp is line a dash b dash as the front view and line ab as the top view respectively all right now we'll perform the steps for drawing these projections on the paper draw horizontal line xy as a reference line then locate point a dash at a distance of h1 units above line xy from point a dash making an angle theta with hp draw a line of length equal to ab locate the other point b dash so line a dash b dash will be the front view of line ab now change the position of the observer looking from the top view the projectors are passing through a and b and meet the hp orthogonally at points a and b the line ab is the top view of line ab the length ab is the shortened length of line ab easy right let's move further discussing a case where the line ab is inclined to both hp and vp and its projection will be shorter in length compared to its actual length look at the diagram here line ab is assumed to be parallel to vp but inclined to hp by the angle 45 degrees observe its front view a dash b1 dash on vp gives the true length and the inclination with xy the top view is a shorter line ab1 parallel to xy 
Now the opposite case. The line AB is assumed to be parallel to HP and inclined to BP by the angle 30 degrees. Observe line AB2 is the top view making an angle 30 degrees with VP. Since the line is now assumed to be parallel to HP, its front view is a line A-B2 parallel to XY. At last, to rotate the line A-B2 to the final position, draw the locus of the end point B in front and top views. Locus of the point B dash is a line passing through B1 dash and parallel to XY. With A dash as center and A dash B2 dash as radius, draw an arc cutting the locus line of B1 dash at B dash. The line A dash B dash is the required front view of the given line. Now, similarly, with A as center and AB1, draw an arc cutting the locus line B2 at B. The line AB will be the top view of the given line. Well, this completes the discussion about the projections of the straight line.